so this morning it is almost nine o'clock um i already went to go check out a job this morning made phone calls talked to some customers i already got that out of the way um i didn't film in the morning one forgot the gopro at the house uh charging the battery had the gopro just had no batteries so it is what it is but went back home got the paperwork um got some inspections to do so i'll take you on the road with that um it's just a repair and then we got to write up a couple re-roofs which is not too bad it's going to take us about an hour um to write them up but yeah so we're gonna go to this job here in vista check them out oh it's oceanside see how they're doing so everything's progressing on that side yesterday we did get a little bit of like a downpour slash rain i think it was just like thunderstorms they were predicting and we got some rain with it so it is what it is um everything was 100 percent watertight so we're solid on that part but yeah so let's head to vista check see what they're doing um if i can hop on the roof record what they're doing or if they're getting after it i'll probably just go from the bottom get a little bit of recording of them putting down fell or whatever they're doing and go from there and then we'll head to the to the appointment i'll put you on the ladder and then i'll get on the ladder go up there and kind of explain what we're estimating for the bid and then show you how i look at things and my perspective on it and go from there so yeah peace So it's cool, as you saw, in the recording, I recorded from my phone them doing it. It's a little bit steep. Um, it's not too bad, though. But what you saw was with the red lines and blue lines, that's them just snapping lines when they lay up the tile. It goes completely straight this way, so you can... It's, it's That's just how you lay up tile. Everything's kind of like a pattern, as you, as you can see. Everything's flat over here, so it all lines up. It's super easy to do flat tile s tile it's a little more difficult but i got a call saying they need more tile at another job so what's cool is if you go on google earth right you can go ahead and measure a roof on google earth here i'll, I'll redo it for you you kind of you just start over hit this start and you hit this you see that little circle right there you can measure you just go back and there's a little measuring tool there's a little ruler right at the top of google earth and it helps you measure whatever you need just click it and you can just point it at where you want to measure and then you click add point right there i'm doing this one hand and then you can just drag it all the way up to the corner where you want measured oh shoot add point and then you could go drag it down to that corner right here so you want to measure this triangle piece add point close it off add point and you get 309 feet squared so three squares a little over three squares and that's how you can measure if you're in a pinch and you can't go to the job or nobody's there because it's all they have to do left you can go to measure it on your phone from google or it's pretty cool so that's what we do sometimes and it's always very accurate. It's kind of, I would say, sometimes one to two feet off. So we always add a foot to two feet on each measurement just to if we miss anything. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, cool little fact. If you guys want to know, help you out. If you can't get to the job quick enough, you can always measure it um, or have your guys measure it. Our guys are going to Spring Valley to check for tile. So yeah. But anyways, so now it is 916. We're gonna go ahead to the job and go give a bid. Um, I did get, grab a piece of tile. So after that bid, we have to go back to roofing in San Marcos to see if they can find the tile here. Um, at least we can locate it. They're gonna need it in a few days. So we don't end up in this situation where we need the tile and the guys are almost basically finished. So then they're gonna have to wait. We're gonna start another job and then we have to pull from that job to finish this job. 
Um, I don't like doing that. We don't like doing that here at N1 Budget. We want all the guys there at one singular time in the time frame that we've told the customer. Um, we gotta be upfront and honest about it. Um, we don't like pulling unless it's raining. We make sure everything's watertight. We can do everything in sections, which is pretty cool. But yeah, so let's go ahead and head to the one over here. Um, it's in Oceanside, so I'm guessing it's probably like 15 minutes away, if that. Um, we'll go give them a bid. Previous customer, of course, one of his rental properties. Um, he just has a few questions about his pipes and skylights. Want to make sure they're solid. So we're going to go give him a price on that. And then, yeah. And I'll put the ladder up, see if we can put the ladder up, take the GoPro up there, and I can show you how it gets down on it. And I'll explain my opinion what needs to be done, whether it's a leak repair, skylight, flashings. Um, he already called us. We already know what it is. Um, he just voices concerns. So we'll go in and talk to him about it. All right, let's get to it. Okay, so what we got right here is there's a leak on the inside of her window next to the bathroom. There's a pipe right here, some sliding tiles, broken tiles. But my concern is this pipe, as you can tell, it is cracked. It did have concrete, so all this water will run down here and here, right here, um, kind of going through here. Just like this one, concrete is broken, mastic was put up top, so it is cracked. So yeah, we'll give a bid on probably replacing both of these pipes right here, and then kind of opening up this area to make sure we get it all. So yeah, let's go give her a price and good to go. So as you saw in the clip up there on the roof, um, it was next to the flashing on the upper part not on the right side so what we're gonna do is we're gonna tear off that flat that where that pipe is tear off the concrete double flashing galvanize at the bottom uh, aluminum at the top that's how you have to install flashings um, one base flashing and one aluminum flashing that you see up top uh, so it folds with the tile and then from there uh, you spray paint it and do all that cool stuff to it. Um, I believe, which way did I go? Son of a gun. I think it's one left down there. But yeah, so that's how you have to do it. Um, we're gonna tear two feet, two to three feet to the left of the pipe, uh, two, three feet to the right side of the pipe, and then go all the way down to the bottom of the roof to expose the wood, um, and then go from there. Uh, so we can be 100% sure that we get all the leak. The leak is coming in from, the overhang is about a foot and a half, two feet. So it's coming in from right about there. So you just wanna open up just enough, wide enough, if not a little bit more, that's why I say two to three feet. So when they tear it off, they can go farther than they need to, to make sure that they get the whole leak. Um, so yeah, uh, that's what, what I told her. Um, we'll send them the bid. Hopefully they sign contract and we'll get it done. But yeah, that's pretty much what's all about finding the leak, prognosing the leak, uh, giving a plan of action, what you, what you are going to do, um, and what you recommend. Um, now the price that we give is straightforward. Um, the price does not go down. The only way the price will go up is if there is bad wood, which we don't know until we tear off the roof uh, or tear off the roof in that repair area. But other than that, our prices are pretty solid. So if anybody that is watching this video or is watching this videos for information need a estimate, uh, we will go ahead and give you one as soon as you need it. Give us a call at 760-707-8644 and the company name is A1 Budget Roofing Incorporated or licensed, bonded, and insured. We got it all covered. We can do anything from a small repair to re-roof. Whatever your roofing needs are, we can cover you. We got it all. But yeah, so I sent that back to the office. They'll probably have it done by today, send it out. And if they have any questions, they can always call us uh, if they have any questions about the bid or anything like that. Um, but yeah. Other than that, uh, we got to go ahead to roofing to go look for some tile. 
uh, that we got from the job earlier today in Vista that I showed you just to make sure they have it beforehand. But yeah, all right guys, let's get after it. Let's get the day rolling. Hopefully everybody's enjoying this video. Hopefully these videos are informational. I'm trying to get more in depth into the day to day kind of basis of what I do. Um, being a salesperson, foreman, whatever I need to be that day. Um, so it kind of helps you guys out if you guys want to do this as well. Oh, look, it's Jose. All right, guys. Peace.